when I'm talking about the digital transformation, I have to be more than a delivery, delivery person who's mm -hmm. delivering an item. I'm more into customizing an item, more mm -hmm. into understanding the inquiry that I need to deliver to the client. So uh, let's start with the outdoor solution. Mm -hmm. This is the outdoor where you can see it on the front facade of the buildings or the roads or the bridges, <laughs> tunnels, everywhere. And this is most advanced, more advanced solution for curved angle. Mm -hmm. If you don't want to go with a sharp edge angle, this is mm -hmm. where you can go. And of course, the variety of the pixel pitch can be determined through the viewing distance mm -hmm. where yes. the clients or the first view. P4, P6, and exactly. something, yes. For example, this is P10 and this mm -hmm. is P6, mm -hmm. P8, to go through that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Talking about digital signage, mm -hmm. it's not just, we kept this signage actually on purpose. The reason we kept this, this is the regular common for mm. McDonald's, Burger King, everything yeah. you see the regular signage. Mm -hmm. But we do have something beyond this, mm -hmm. which is called the mosaic art or the random shape signages. Mm -hmm. Okay, I can randomly draw my design of digital signage and I can technically loop them all together to show me one content at a time mm -hmm. or individual contents on each screen. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The sizes never matter, whether the size of each individual screen or the full uh, screen. Okay. This is our type of expertise in the static signages. Mm -hmm. Each sample of this having a specs that drawn by the consultant or the contractor that required this X, uh, Y, and Z steps. For example, this is a Mugrabi uh, glasses and sunglasses. Mm -hmm. This is mm -hmm. their specs, and this is and Mugrabi is with us also for the mm -hmm. manufacturer. This is H and M. This is movie cinema for the kids cinema. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Plenty of other samples. Well, mostly, such a lead mm. time, what is the lead time for uh, manufacturing? Yes, it depends on the size, depends on the specs, depends on each project. Minimum, yeah, minimum because you have the capacity as you mentioned. Yeah, awesome and very nice. Again, when I'm saying let's go out or beyond the scene, okay? I do have a digital signage and I do have a brain and I do have like out of box ideas. So regardless of this design of shaping for the digital signages and regardless of what product I'm using, this is called pick and learn product, where I pick the product and all the information of the product will automatically mm -hmm. and wirelessly shown on the screen, mm -hmm. okay? Yeah. Once this comes back, the screen will remain on the demo mode where I can play another type of content where I will do have a double effect visualization for the mm -hmm. screen that hangs on the wall. This is nice and attractive and affordable price. But again, for, this is for my client. But for me as a company, okay, there is something more interesting to that, which is this would give me a background dashboard with analysis. How many times this item has been picked? Mm -hmm. How many times I've sold this item? Oh, this is picked 100 times, this is 50. So there is something wrong with this. I need to redisplay this, make a discount on this item, etc. Correct. So at the sales management, this is my real interest. Mm -hmm. You know, this is simply the product can go with any type, any shape of design, mm -hmm. any size of screen. The matter is with the sensor that's seated in the item itself. Mm -hmm. I can program plenty of items. Good. Or sharp peelers, it can go circle, it's a flexible panels, flexible uh, modules where it can fill to wrap as a candy bar mm -hmm. to the peelers. Whether it's outdoor or indoor, both solutions are applicable. And this is also, I mean you can you can display the graphics content. This is an interactive smart mirror. It's a mirror where I can see myself. I pick the product, whatever the product is, let's say this is a perfume. Whenever I touch the screen with the perfume, okay, object, 
the perfume or the cosmetics or the product item will be appearing on the screen and I will have variety of products and catalogs that where I can surf and see what is this item and I can interact it's on this with this item itself on the screen and then I can return it back to screen mode to see myself how this shirt would look like mm -hmm. if I were Now this product is mainly for a booking room screens that been installed beside offices where you can install it and schedule your booking of the booking rooms mm -hmm. and at the same time it can be demo unit for your works for your identity whatever is it it can be interactive or it can be solid digital screen this is start from 10 inch 13 inch then can go bigger until 98 inch but do you recommend such thing for the hotels I mean, uh, hotel of course area? Most uh, hotels are doing a digital transformation now, and this digital transformation is going to be instead of having a panel or a room number, you would have a smart. Screen. Yes, we we have one query for 50 units, um, like 10 inches yeah. uh, display in each room. Yeah, this would mm. once you are integrated now, all the hospitality sector have been also developed and advanced mm. using advanced hospitality system. Mm. This is like a welcoming screen beside your, you know, beside yeah, your room. It will write your correct. name, your yeah, ticket even. Yeah. It would give you reminders. It depends on the system that you are using in the background. Let's talk two times over here. Mm -hmm. This is a video wall. Mm -hmm. Correct. With the specific and special dimensions, the phasal mm -hmm. of the screen, the size of the screen, how much ever big or small video wall, it depends. But I'm not using this video wall as a display wall only, paying all that cost. No, I integrated this video wall with something very smart, which is interactive table to mm -hmm. present and display my product. Mm -hmm. I do have an object. I will magnetically put the project or the object on the table and boom, I'm talking about a product, which is a car, for example, I'm a car showroom. Mm -hmm. I have different varieties of options, technology, design, performance, safety. Okay, I need to check the safety of the car. Here all the information of the safety of the car. And then I can rotate the object to go to the design, for example. Mm -hmm. I need to see something in the design. Mm. Then I will finish that. I need to check this design or this think of the of the car after I'm checking on the table I'll push to have it on my display on the large display again the same display it can be interactive where I can interact with my content and continue <coughs> explaining about my product I've cut 60 to 80 percent of the convenience elements with any person I'm presenting to him through this very small customized solution like this is you have done internally this is called yeah, this is the customization exactly and you are getting the uh, product from local market and then customizing it and 100%. then you, so in your factory uh, you usually you are only doing the customization part you are not manufacturing I'm something assembling the component together to come mm. up with a new product no product to the market, yeah which is not not available you cannot mm. yeah you cannot find this product available online or Someone is doing it, you know. Yeah, you yeah. have to customize it. Correct. Everybody can do it, but the know-how mm. is the secret factor of the key. Correct. But by the way, which screen is this? Uh, Samsung this or is, Philips? No, this is Philips. Fifty-five Philips. inch, one point mm. seven bezel, mm -hmm. with a push-back bracket where you can push. Mm -hmm. And then the came. <coughs> This is usually this kind of uh, display for navigation you're using in the malls mm. to yes. navigate the location yes. of the... At the yes. same time, yes. mm. I can use this mm. table mm. as a presentation to present myself. Mm. Okay, you are a cinema client, mm. okay, and I need to show off mm. my muscles with the cinema business that I'm mm. doing. So I'm going to show you, sir, now. Mm. Mm. Sorry. No problem. What is the cinema, mm. all the cinemas that I've done across GCC, 
without forcing myself to keep talking and explaining myself, mm. the vision or the video can talk about my professionalism and, and what yeah. I can do. Seeing is all. believing. Exactly, 100%. Yeah. Yeah. Again, when I do have to explain, I'm explaining the challenges that I had in those projects, mm. how sensitive they are, and mm. what is the 3,200 square meters of statics. Mm. LED, digital signages, RGB lighting. Mm -hmm. Correct. Talking about the transparency, mm. everybody can get your transparent screen, mm -hmm. but no one can get it for you without with zero foils, mm. with zero aluminium foils. Mm. Our specialty that we customized mm. transparent LED screen with zero aluminium foils that you can show the full facade of the indoor screens mm. for the transparent screen. By the way, just for the curiosity, uh, what is the harm of having the aluminium foil? You will see the other screen, the mm. other transparent screen, and you will see what is the okay. harm of having okay. aluminium foil. Okay. Okay. We've got the one of the largest worldwide Nike flagship stores mm. in Dubai Mall mm. for a full facade of transparent mm -hmm. with zero foil mm -hmm. and for this world only mm -hmm. small world with zero foil aluminium mm -hmm. we had to go to nike netherland mm -hmm. to take the approval of, of nike mm -hmm. uh, management on the mm -hmm. screen and we've got it and we've installed it you will see it live okay now. okay you have any picture of yeah, that yeah i'll show you okay okay store. okay so this is one of your specialty yes okay and usually who is the target customer for this uh, transparent? Most of malls. banking, retailers, mm. malls, mm -hmm. any any commercial. In brands. banking sector, where it is more applicable? And do you it's have any the success? Second, mm. Yeah, you have double facade in the banks always. Okay. You have the ATM corridor, mm. okay. which is the front facade. And then mm. you have the other glass facade after you enter for the... Uh, Okay. So, so this is a target. Do you today. have any uh, customer base here in banking yes, sector also? Yes, yes. Which bank? We'll talk about it. We'll show it to you. Okay. Because we are delivering, we are working with all bank. But we have another Green LED. Mm. Mm. The concept is what is the type of content that I'm showing on that corner. Mm. So one of our specialty is a content so creation. It's a month that I keep receiving mm. the cold. It's okay. This is a completely mm. depth content. Okay. Where it shows you vision mm -hmm. of like there is a depth in your <coughs> artistic corner. It's not just like a screen and let's display anything that we will pop up on it. Mm. No, it's a real artistic. Uh, so it is showing 3D. So you prepared the content like yes, that. Yes, exactly. Okay. Nowadays, in uh, uh, you can see in the new um, uh, up, uh, new uh, uh, houses, new villas. You can see the windows also. They yeah. people are preparing yeah. in this L shape. Yeah. So this is very much in uh, in terms of uh, fashion. Exactly. Yeah. So that is the also one of the factor you are yes. covering. Exactly. Okay. Okay. Like a visual streams. It can pop up content. It's when I'm coming next to the screen, mm. there is a sensor trigger mm. that will trigger me that if I'm a youth or I'm an old guy or I'm mm. a woman, and it will pop up the advertising that I'm looking for. for okay. That targeted audience. Mm -hmm. ah. A woman with a child, something would be pop up like for a woman and child. Mm. A grandpa with his wife, something will be pop up for a grandpa, you know? So you must be installing some cameras, I mean... Uh, yes, uh, cameras and sensors. So, so it will attract according to your age group. Exactly. Actually, th that is that is nothing to do with the screen. No, no. It is your no. smart content yes, management. Exactly. Uh, uh, so yeah. here is what I'm talking about. We are not... A regular mm. SI suppliers. We are not mm. purchasing LED screens from X, Y, and Z factory and supply it to you. Here you go. Your, a middleman. your whole emphasis is on customization, which is your core business. Exactly. Uh, you exactly. are depending on that, and that's why you are getting so many other products and a, incorporating. I'm not a real estate mm. office, you know. <laughs> I, I do have an apartment with mm. some ownership, and I'm finding a client <laughs> to rent it out or sell it. Mm. So, no. Okay. 
Let's what talk next? a little bit about here. Mm -hmm. uh, if you can stand here, please. Yeah. Or anywhere you can over there. KFD, yeah? Yeah. This is like a regular static picture where it has elements of towers, icon towers of Saudi Arabia, for example. Mm. All right? And I do have a mapping projection scanner system where it's, it can scan the elements inside my drawings and pop up visual, visual arts like lighting, video, or even a picture on top of this exact certain areas I'm showing in my static. Mm -hmm. Beside that, I can transform this to be interactive. Wherever I touch the Kingdom Tower, a visual art will be shown to present something about the post the Kingdom Tower, for example. So this is a pretty amazing solution for mapping projection where it can go for indoor yes. and yes. also the outdoor. Okay. Also the same tower, I can make the same concept on so that tower in the outdoor. Yeah, yeah, does it make also, you can make a projection on the building itself? Yes, that's what I'm saying. Okay. Okay. This is a small simulation for what I can do for the indoor and also the outdoor. Mm. It's because it's an outdoor screen first mm. and it has the aluminium foils where mm. it can be built on the facade. This is total transparent mm. screen where you can see through. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay. But that kind of uh, screen you can also prepare. Yeah, 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 of course. Virtual reality content type. Mm. For example, for real estates, mm. villas, like a mock up villa, we can build it as a 3D mm -hmm. uh, virtual reality and when you, you can surf it. Okay.